Hello, so in this video I want to show you how you can list all the past Wi-Fi endpoints your computer connected to or a computer connected to and the passwords associated with those Wi-Fi endpoints. So how did I do this? There's a command in Windows called NetSH which stands for Network Shell and it allows an admi to administer your network connections, your you know, connection speeds, and those are the uh, Wi-Fi connection profiles. So there's this WLAN, and you can, for instance, say show profiles, and that will list all the Wi-Fi endpoints or all, all the Wi-Fi profiles the computer knows about, or this, this user has used. You can also, uh, let me clear the screen, you can also run this entirely on the command line so you don't have to do it interactively. How it and how you do it is just you concatenate these commands. So net sh wlan show profiles lists all the Wi-Fi profiles of the that this user has has leveraged. One thing then you can do in particular is you can let's say there's one that I know of. It's a test network called Citra, and so if you run that, you get then so with the name command you can see more information about details of this particular profile. And here's now a very interesting feature, which is, let me clear the screen to show this. So if you add this part to this command, let me zoom in so you can actually see it well. So if you add key equals clear to this command we just ran, so let's run it. You get again the output and detailed information and in particular you're going to get back this line and this key content is actually the password so what my script the function the powershell function that i showed in the beginning actually does it goes through all the wi-fi profiles and runs this key equals clear command and to get that script you can go to github so check out windowwood z23 slash scratch in particular down here is uh this is the get wi-fi just the the powershell function and you can copy that out i just you know you can curl it if you'd like but copy it and then you know put it in the powershell window so to declare the function and let's walk through what this actually does in more detail so it de defines the function and then it runs netsh to list all the profiles. SLS stands for select string and it's kind of like grab, so to speak, if you're familiar with Linux or Unix. And then for each row, for each Wi-Fi profile we get back, so this is sort of this for each, kind of loop through and we'll kind of extract the name of the Wi-Fi. If it's not empty, we're going to read, this is now this command we ran, right, which shows uh, key equals clear, and extracting again using SLS, the key content line. If that line exists and is not null, right, then we're actually going to print out the value. So we print out the name of the Wi-Fi profile plus the key contents. And then so you define that function, and then you can just run it, oops, you can run it and you'll get the passwords of all the Wi-Fi endpoints back. I hope this was useful. Uh, subscribe to my channel if you like it. Uh, yeah, like the video and uh, see you soon again.